Hello and welcome back to my channel, A Dose of Dads. Okay, so today I'm deciding to work on like a household piggy bank. And I'm using a plastic container that some cheese puffs from Sam's Club came in. And I'm just sanding it down so I can actually, you know, layer the paint on. Second step after sanding, I'm taking some gesso and covering the entire container so I have a better base to paint on and kind of get rid of some of those rough textures from the sandpaper. So after several layers of gesso, I finally put the container off to the side and the lid off to the side so they can dry and actually sketch out my concept or my idea. At first I thought about doing kind of like a pirate theme or something that can kind of fit in with the overall like theme of like the living room or something, which right now is like Native American. Um, but I decided that's kind of not what I wanted to go with, and I decided to do the first initial of my family's last name, which is P. So, I looked on Google, found a really nice, um, fancy P, and decided to sketch it out, and that's going to be the idea for the piggy bank. <laughs> So just like all my other ideas today, this one wasn't really thought out with the color scheme. Um, at this point I still haven't decided what I was going to use and I kind of <laughs> went for the marker that stood out the most, which is blue because blue is like my favorite color. So a lot of things that I do are blue, uh, which I actually like the blue, I thought it was really nice. And I actually had some blue paint that was very similar to the marker that I used. And overall, so far, I really like the design. I decided to put, like, a green lid for, like, money, piggy bank. Because um, it, it, it kind of goes, but it, I guess at the same time, it really doesn't. But overall, I really like the whole idea that I sketched.
hindsight, I probably should have used like a darker color. Um, but I went for a lighter marker because I didn't want to completely mess up the white background. Um, but I noticed that there's some areas like with the swirls going around that were kind of not as flattering. Like I should have brought it in a little tighter to make more of a circle and I didn't do that. So in hindsight, I should have took my time a little bit more with sketching out the idea, which I thought I did because honestly it took me like a good 30 minutes to really sketch this out. painting I noticed that there was a lot of like patchiness and I even had some water droplets drop on the white um, well the gesso and take off some of the paint um, it was weird and I kind of thought about like getting some like black spray paint and spray painting the inside that way you know it wouldn't look as patchy but
at this point I'm just adding in some last minute changes which is glitter um, touching up the black touching up the white adding the final black line and trying to clean up my workspace which for future reference now I know not to put glitter on a silicone mat <laughs> but um, the end product I really liked I think it looks really good I'm extremely happy with it um, right now I'm sitting in the corner of my room and um, I like the sparkle but it's really cute so that's it for today thank you guys and um, see you next time